What's good, YouTube? It's been a minute since I did this, um, but I'm here to bring you a free VST for 808s for Mixcraft. I f finally found one that's actually worth, like, um, kind of being everybody's go-to for 808s, because I know Mixcraft doesn't really have any options for 808s, so. All right, it's called uh, Kick One VST. I'm gonna put it in the description below. Um, it's just, the 808 that come out of this thing is crazy. It sounds like a, a professional one, so hold on. Let me uh, just default it real quick so you can hear what it sounds like default it. Throw in some notes. Oh, you already hear that right there. Okay. This thing is like really loud, so advise you to turn on your headphones. Just turn up the release because it's like plucky right now. This is like an EDM one, uh, like they have so many ones. Like you can, these are supposed to be kicks, but I turn them into 808s by um, increasing the release. So I just go to one like this one, let's see. Increasing the release, hold on. Or is it on this one? There we go. Increase the drive for distortion. They got EQs. They got EQs in here. Increase the low end. Now, um, you could just, so you don't have to keep doing this, you could just render it out, uh, like mix down to audio track. And then put it in in like um, your drum kit folder. Like um, I have one where all my beat samples are. This is like mine's. I just come here and I grab that and I throw it into the alpha sampler. And that way you can um, you can just uh, control it more easily. But you gotta make sure that it's on the key of C, or or else this isn't gonna line up with the um, correct keys. And now I can do uh, other things to it, um, put effects on it, even though this thing is beefy as it is. Hold on, let me bring down this pattern. Bring up the release. Put on the monophonic mode so they don't overlap. Hold on, this is too low, so we're gonna go to C5 and it's gonna switch the, uh, is this gonna up it in an octave? Actually, no, C3. Where is it at? For those of you who's wondering uh, what this root key thing is for it's actually for this root key thing sometimes 808s come in like out of key so um like say if i had an 808 i pulled in an 808 that was um hold on just off track a little bit i know some people have been going through this for that root key thing let me find an 808 all right this 808 is G sharp. I wonder if they have that in here. I think this is G sharp. Boom. So now I put it that as the root key. I mean root key. When I play C, it's gonna play C. Oops. Hold on. But most, you know, 808 drum kits they don't show you the key, so you have to go by ear. But 
that was a little off topic, but yeah, that's what that's from. So with this thing, um, let me go through more of the presets. I know somebody in the comments gonna go crazy if I don't. All right, they got more EDM like hard stop hard style kicks. You can also save these as kicks as well. Release that. It's like that X type of uh, 808. glide thing somebody's probably gonna ask about that I don't know um, this thing does not work like it doesn't it reverses the notes it's so dumb I thought I thought it was gonna work thought I finally found something that uh, glided correctly but it doesn't see I'm about to overlap the notes so I overlap them I'm gonna put this glide on It just like reverses the notes, it's ridiculous. I mean, that, that could be a cool effect for somebody. Oops. Uh. Yeah, that doesn't work, but um, how you get glide is you gotta have, because Mixcraft didn't do it this time, you gotta, the, the effect, the instrument that you put in has to have it. Like, um, they have to have a legato. So, uh, Massive has it, um, let me see if this, this thing has it, uh, da, 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 glide, yeah, that one has it, let me see if I can glide this 808 that I made back in the other tutorial. Low key. my 808 preset on there. Set this glide a whole octave. That kind of worked. Uh, you can control how long it's gliding for. Uh, the, the more you push it to the right, the longer it glides. That kind of works, uh, not as good as massive, but uh, you can probably fin do some finessing. But uh, I'm gonna end the video here. I'm gonna put the link in the description for this is one, this one. You guys can have fun with that. Uh, hopefully, you come out with some crazy 808s. This is Dice's and I'm out.